John Ford Coley met his music partner, Dan Seals, in Texas. Dan's nickname was England Dan due to his fake British accent while pretending to be the fifth Beatle. He should have known better. Everybody knows I was going to be the fifth Beatle, of course. Well, the duo became a powerhouse. A lot of hit songs. Songs like Nights Are Forever Without You and Love Is The Answer. John continues their legacy while creating new music for his fans. I want you to welcome one of my favorites, John Ford Coley. Yeah. Thank you. John, when you and Dan were together, because you guys both grew up in Dallas, Texas, and, mm -hmm. and, and formed a band, and then ended up deciding as a duo you could really do something, when did it occur to you that you were creating something very unique in the music world, a different sound, and that it was gonna work? You know, I don't think we ever thought we were gonna create anything different. We really? were just trying to play. You know, that's, <laughs> we just wanted to put food on the table. And, and it took off and had a life of its own. We just kind of marveled at the whole process. You are a classically trained piano player. A lot of people do not know that about you. Right, that's, uh, I've, I've spent years watching Lawrence Welk. As a matter of fact, <laughs> My parents would not allow me to watch Gunsmoke or Paladin unless I watched Mitch Miller and Lawrence Welk first. Was That's, that your punishment? Did you? Have you know, it, turned, it was kind of a punishment at that age, but as you got older, you go, yeah, it's pretty good. That's, I like that stuff. One of these albums that I really want to mention is this one, John Ford Coley, Long Way Home, live in Israel and L.A. You and I talked earlier that you have, as I do, a real love for the Absolutely. nation of Israel. Yes, sir. You've been and there again, many times. And I just want to publicly acknowledge the thank you that you have stood for Israel for so long. You've been such a support, and, and we all love it. We all follow your example in that. Well, I appreciate that. And I appreciate you because so many performers won't even go to Israel because they get criticized. And your courage in standing with Israel is something I admire very much. Mm -hmm. And then this book I want to mention, Backstage Pass, about a lot of the people that you've had a chance to meet mm -hmm. and uh, some great stories of behind the scenes at uh, the world of music. So it's a great opportunity. I, 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 I tell everybody I hear it's funny. I haven't read it myself. <laughs> you just wrote it? I just wrote it. You know, <laughs> so. But it's not about drug, sex, and rock and roll. It's just about all the funny things that would go along when we'd be out on the road. I love that kind of story. And this 26 songs on this album called Eclectic, uh, John, you've had such an, a phenomenal impact on music, but if I brought you here and we didn't make some music, I'd be cheating our audience both here in the studio and at home. So Absolutely. you want to do something maybe musically? I, I sure do. Let's well, play a couple. I think we ought to do that, because in a moment, John is going to perform the timeless hit, I'd Really Love to See You Tonight. But first, Keith Bilbrey is going to tell you how to get more of John's music and his book. To get John Ford Coley's Long Way Home live from Israel, head to his website, johnfordcoley.com.